So in White People News, the BBC has caused a bit of a stir by asking, is there a future for white people in South Africa? Obviously, the BBC does not read You magazine and Eschonet. Hmm? Hmm? They say farmers are being killed. And I don't want to trivialize farmers being killed. But they fail to mention that farm workers are also victims of these attacks. Like in a movie, right? When the tornado comes and it is, we don't worry about the rest of the people in the movie. We worry about Will Smith and his family. We don't worry about anyone else. So the BBC, basically what they're saying is, let's worry about the stirrings. And in this particular case, the stirring are the farmers. The BBC also claim that they say that there are as many as 400,000 poor white people living in more than 80 white townships. I, I need to go there. I need to see this. I mean, why should we be more concerned that white people are poor? I mean, should we be less concerned that they are, because there are other poor races. In other countries in the world, it's, it's not unusual for white people to be poor. But in South Africa, it has to be front page news. Because most white people claim that they were against apartheid. Fine, but let's admit you did make most of the situation. You're like, I don't like this thing, but yeah, I will, uh, I will, I will uh, take the house in Parkhurst, uh, and I will live in Constantia. Don't know, how, uh, yeah, the Clermont House, yeah, I like it as well. And if there's really four hundred thousand white poor people, how come I don't have a white maid? We at LNN are going to test whether this poor white problem reported by the, P by the BBC is actually a real thing. We investigate. We get deep. We get involved. Check us out. News that moves. ENCA.com.